This video is to show the new ability to integrate your email list, contacts, and prospects between your customer focus system and constant contact. To begin, you should have set up a constant contact account. And you'll want to link that account to your customer focus system. To do that, you're going to go up into settings, which is located on the dashboard within your customer focus system. If you click on settings up in the top right, that will take you into the admin area. Once you're in the admin area, you'll go over to system located on the toolbar and select constant contact from the system dropdown. You'll want to click on Get Access Token, and this will prompt you to fill out your username and password for your constant contact. You'll also need to click Allow Access. And that is now connected your constant contact profile, including any email list contacts that you have in constant contact. And now it's integrated with your customer focus system. So we'll go ahead and get started with actually looking at that integration and how to create email list within your customer focus system. So we'll go up to the toolbar and click on the house or the home button and this will take you back to your dashboard. From the dashboard you'll want to go to integrations located on the toolbar and select constant contact from the drop down. The integration screen will show you any email list that you have created any marketing tags that you have created as well, and you can filter your contacts by the marketing tag that has been put on their original customer contact account. You can also search contact type by all, prospect, or customers. I've selected all so you can see any contacts within my customer focus system listed here. The first thing you want to do to bring any existing information in from Constant Contact is to go over to the Synchronize tab up at the top. And you're going to see some information. It should show you some of the status that you have within Constant Contact. And to sync that information and bring it in correctly to your customer focus system, you'll want to click on Update Customer Focus from Constant Contact. What that does is it brings your email list and any contacts within those lists back into your customer focus system. So if we now click on manage email list, and I'm going to go ahead and refresh, we should see the email list that were brought over from constant contact within that drop down. So you can see there are a few different promotions and email lists that have already been set up. To create a new email list, you can either do that in Constant Contact or you can do it in Customer Focus. To create a new email list from within Customer Focus, you'll want to click on New List, give it a name, and click Add. You now can choose which customers you want to put into that email list. So you want to make sure it's selected up here at the top. So we've got our new email list, Summer Discount Promos. And then I can come down now and you'll see a checkbox to the far right of all the contacts information. 
and I can just simply check which contacts I want to add to that new email list that I created. So I've selected a few. Now what I can do now is I want to synchronize this information back into my constant contact so I can send that email campaign. So I'm going to go back to the Synchronize tab. I'm going to choose Update Constant Contact from Customer Focus. All right, so we're going to go back in and check our Constant Contact. Click on Summer Discount Promo underneath that email list so you can see that one that we created in Customer Focus. And that has the three contacts that we selected to that email list. Now if I go back to Customer Focus, I can also manage my email list here. And if I want, I can remove contacts from an email list just by unchecking them. So I just definitely want to make sure that I'm in the correct email list and then I can just uncheck those contacts. And then just remember every time that you make any changes either within your customer focus or within your constant contact, you want to make sure that you finally come over to the synchronize tab and click on one of these options, either updating your constant contact from customer focus or updating customer focus from constant contact. Thank you so much and that concludes our new video on the integration that we now offer between constant contact and customer focus. Thank you so much.